Today we are checking in with Councilwoman Shamika Parrish Wright. She represents District 3. You can see it right here on your map. It includes much of Shively, parts of Crumbs Lane, 7th Street Road, and a little bit of Dixie Highway. So let's start, Councilwoman, with that new District 3 Advisory Board. I know you had your first meeting last night. I love this concept where you're really bringing the community in to be a part of the decision making. How does it work? Yes, my team and I want to make sure the community is a part of every decision we make and we have the budgetary process is coming up and we want them to help set the priorities. We also break things down around street cleaning, around how cracks and things in the sidewalks can get fixed and they're going to help be our messengers throughout the district to explain the different processes and how you get things done. So what are you hearing as far as priorities go? What did, what did the board share last night that they're like, we really need to focus on this? What I think a lot of people don't understand is that when you're running, everyone says, hey, what are you going to do in your first 100 days? But I will tell you 90 days in, it is really simple of getting back to the general government of understanding who picks up my trash? What happens to the cats in my community? People want to make sure that kids have a place to play, that seniors can age in place and get the home repair that they need. But people really care about the beautification of their neighborhood and their homes and keeping their neighborhoods safe. It's kind of actually, um, there's beauty in that simplicity. Yes, it is. Of just getting back to what people really need. Okay, well before we let you go, we want to make sure we mention New podcast out. Yes. You just released episode one on housing, is that right? Yes, we got to meet with amazing director Marilyn Harris, and it is an amazing just first run of our podcast. We're going to have a series of people coming in, talking about the processes, how people can get services and connected. It's going to connect to our mailing that we went out, that we sent out to people, so that they know who do you call. And redistricting still has impacted District 3 in a great way. Mm -hmm. So we want people to know services and care, and then we even have people People who are in unincorporated parts of the district, we're educating people and we're building community along the way. Where can they find the podcast? The podcast is now on our website. So if you go to the Louisville Metro website and you look up District 3, you will see the podcast. It's also on our social media sites and on YouTube. So if okay. you Google Shamika Parish Wright or Louisville Metro Council District 3, you will find the podcast there. Very good. Well, thank, thank you. you for spending some time with us this Thanks afternoon. Thanks for having me, as usual. And we